Religious Zionism Hebrew, Zionut Datit translate. Zionut Datit, or Dati Lumi Dati Layumi, national religious, or Kippa Surga Kippa Suruga, literally, knitted skullcap, is an ideology that combines Zionism and Orthodox Judaism. Before the establishment of the State of Israel, religious Zionists were mainly observant Jews who supported Zionist efforts to build a Jewish state in the land of Israel. After the Six-Day War, and the capture of the West Bank, a territory referred to in Jewish terms as Judea and Samaria, right-wing components of the religious Zionist movement integrated nationalist revindication, and evolved into Neo-Zionism. Their ideology revolves around three pillars, the Land of Israel, the People of Israel, and the Torah of Israel. History In 1862, German Orthodox rabbi Zvi Hirsch Kalischer published his tractate Derishit Zion, positing that the salvation of the Jews, promised by the prophets, can come about only by self-help. Rabbi Moshe Shmuel Glasner was another prominent rabbi who supported Zionism. The main ideologue of modern religious Zionism was Rabbi Abraham Isaac Cook, who justified Zionism according to Jewish law, and urged young religious Jews to support efforts to settle the land, and the secular labor Zionists to give more consideration to Judaism. Cook saw Zionism as a part of a divine scheme which would result in the resettlement of the Jewish people in its homeland. This would bring salvation gula, to Jews, and then to the entire world. After world harmony is achieved by the refoundation of the Jewish homeland, the Messiah will come. Although this has not yet happened, Cook emphasized that it would take time, and that the ultimate redemption happens in stages, often not apparent while happening. In 1924, when Cook became the Ashkenazi chief rabbi of Palestine, he tried to reconcile Zionism with Orthodox Judaism. Ideology <inaudible> <inaudible> Topic. Religious Jews believe that Eretz Yisrael, the land of Israel, was promised to the ancient Israelites by God, and the right of the Jews to the land is permanent and inalienable. To generations of diaspora Jews, Jerusalem has been a symbol of the Holy Land and of their return to it, as promised by God in numerous biblical prophecies. Despite this, many Jews did not embrace Zionism before the 1930s, and certain religious groups opposed it then, as some groups still do now, on the grounds that an attempt to re-establish Jewish rule in Israel by human agency was blasphemous. Hastening salvation and the coming of the Messiah was considered religiously forbidden, and Zionism was seen as a sign of disbelief in God's power, and therefore, a rebellion against God. Rabbi Cook developed a theological answer to that claim, which gave Zionism a religious legitimation. Zionism was not merely a political movement by secular Jews. It was actually a tool of God to promote his divine scheme, and to initiate the return of the Jews to their homeland, the land he promised to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. God wants the children of Israel to return to their home in order to establish a Jewish sovereign state in which Jews could live according to the laws of Torah and Halakha, and commit the mitzvah of Eretz Israel these are religious commandments which can be performed only in the land of Israel. Moreover, to cultivate the land of Israel was a mitzvah by itself, and it should be carried out. Therefore, settling Israel is an obligation of the religious Jews, and helping Zionism is actually following God's will. Religious Jews also disapproved of the Zionists because many were secular Jews or atheists, taking their cue from Marxism. Socialist Zionism envisaged the movement as a tool for building an advanced socialist society in the land of Israel, while solving the problem of antisemitism. The early kibbutz was a communal settlement that focused on national goals, unencumbered by religion and precepts of Jewish law such as kashrut. Socialist Zionists were one of the results of a long process of modernization within the Jewish communities of Europe, known as the Haskalah, or Jewish Enlightenment. Rabbi Cook's answer was as follows. Secular Zionists may think they do it for political, national, or socialist reasons, but in fact, the actual reason for them coming to resettle in Israel is a religious Jewish spark, nitzatz, in their soul, planted by God. Without their knowledge, they are contributing to the divine scheme and actually committing a great mitzvah. The role of religious Zionists is to help them to establish a Jewish state and turn the religious spark in them into a great light. 
They should show them that the real source of Zionism and the long for Zion is Judaism and teach them Torah with love and kindness. In the end, they will understand that the laws of Torah are the key to true harmony and a socialist state not in the Marxist meaning that will be a light for the nations and bring salvation to the world. Shlomo Avenary explained the last part of Cook's answer. And the end of those pioneers, who scout into the blindness of secularism and atheism, but the treasured light inside them leads them into the path of salvation, their end is that from doing mitzvah without purpose, they will do mitzvah with a purpose. Page 222, 1. Topic. Organizations Topic. The first rabbis to support Zionism were Yehuda Shlomo Alkali and Zvi Hirsch Kalisher. They argued that the change in the status of Western Europe's Jews following emancipation was the first step toward redemption, Gwell, and that, therefore, one must hasten the messianic salvation by a natural salvation, whose main pillars are the kibbutz Galiot, gathering of the exiles, the return to Eretz Israel, agricultural work, but Dev, and the revival of the everyday use of the Hebrew language. The Mizrachi organization was established in 1902 in Vilna at a World Conference of Religious Zionists. It operates a youth movement, B'nai Akiva, which was founded in 1929. Mizrachi believes that the Torah should be at the center of Zionism, a sentiment expressed in the Mizrachi Zionist slogan M. Yisrael Biaritz Yisrael al Pi Torat Yisrael, the people of Israel in the land of Israel according to the Torah of Israel. It also sees Jewish nationalism as a tool for achieving religious objectives. Mizrachi was the first official religious Zionist party. It also built a network of religious schools that exist to this day. In 1937-1948, the religious kibbutz movement established three settlement blocks of three kibbutzim each. The first was in the Beit Sheen Valley, the second was in the Hebron Mountains south of Bethlehem known as Gush Etzion, and the third was in the western Negev. Kibbutz Yavna was founded in the center of the country as the core of a fourth block that came into being after the establishment of the state. Topic. Political parties Topic. The labor movement wing of religious Zionism, founded in 1921 under the Zionist slogan, Torah Vavoda, Torah and Labor, was called Hapoel Hamazrachi. It represented religiously traditional labor Zionists, both in Europe and in the land of Israel, where it represented religious Jews in the Histadrit. In 1956 Mizrachi, Hapol Hamizrachi, and other religious Zionists formed the National Religious Party to advance the rights of religious Zionist Jews in Israel. Other parties and groups affiliated with religious Zionism are Gush Emunim, T. Kuma, and Mimad. A radical branch of religious Zionism, Kahanism was founded by Rabbi Meir Kahane, whose party, Kach, was eventually banned for racism. Today, Atzma Yehudit is the leading wing of this school of thought. Topic. Educational institutions Topic. The flagship religious institution of the religious Zionist movement is the yeshiva founded by Rabbi Abraham Isaac Cook, called in his honor, Merkaz Harav, lit. the rabbi's center. Other religious Zionist institutions are Yeshivat or Etzion, founded by Rav Chaim Druckmann, a foremost disciple of Rabbi Tzvi Yehuda Cook, Yeshivat Machen Meir, Yeshivat Har Etzion, Yeshivat Hakotel, Yeshivat Berkat Moshe in Ma'ale Adumim, Yeshivat Har Bracha, Yeshivat Har Hamer, Ein Hanaziv Women's Seminary, and the Yaakov Herzog Institute for Jewish Studies. Topic. Dress Topic. Religious Zionists are often called kippet srugat, referring to the knitted or crocheted skullcaps Hebrew kippa, place. Kippet, worn by men. Other types of head coverings are worn, such as kippet in black velvet. Topic. Newspapers Topic. Some religious Zionist newspapers censor images of women. Topic. Politics Topic. 
Most religious Zionists embrace right-wing politics, especially the religious right-wing Jewish Home Party, but also support the mainstream right-wing Likud. There are also some left-wing religious Zionists, such as Rabbi Michael Melchior, whose views were represented by the Mimid Party which ran together with the Israeli Labour Party. Many Israeli settlers in the West Bank are religious Zionists, along with most of the settlers forcibly expelled from the Gaza Strip in August and September 2005. However, some move to the West Bank for economic reasons, particularly new immigrants such as those from the FSU who cannot afford the cost of living in cities such as Tel Aviv. Topic. Military service Topic. All adult Jewish males in Israel are obligated to serve in the IDF. Certain segments of orthodoxy defer their service in order to engage in full-time Torah study. Religious Zionist belief advocates that both are critical to Jewish survival and prosperity. For this reason, many religious Zionist men take part in the Hesder program, which allows military service to be combined with yeshiva studies. Some others attend a pre-army Mechina educational program, delaying their service by one year. 88% of Hesder students belong to combat units, compared to a national average of below 30%. In November 2010, the IDF held a special conference which was attended by the heads of religious Zionism in order to encourage female religious Zionists to join the IDF. The IDF promised it would make sure that all modesty and kosher issues will be handled in order to make female religious Zionists comfortable. While some religious Zionist women serve in the army, most choose national service, known as Sherat Layumi, instead working at hospitals, schools, and day care centers. Notable figures Yehuda Amital, Eli Satan, Shlomo Avener, Naftali Bennett, Yosef Berg, Shi'ar Yashav Cohen, Rabbi Chaim Druckmann, Effie Edom, Mordecai Eliyahu, Moshe Feiglin, Shlomo Gorin, Yitzhak Halevi Herzog, Mayor Kahane, Benjamin Ziev Kahane, Zvi Hirsch Kalisher Avraham Yitzchak Cook, Zvi Yehuda Cook, Dov Lior, Zevulin Orlov, Shlomo Riskin, Avraham Shapira, Shal Yisraeli, Ori Amos Cherky. Topic. See also. Topic. Orthodox Judaism. Hartel. Herdim and Zionism Modern Orthodox Judaism Religion in Israel Achalta de Gula Eretz Shiva Hesder Machen Mayer Mamlakti Dati Torato Omenudo References Topic. Bibliography Topic. The Zionist Idea and Its Variations by Shlomo Avenary, M. Ovd Publishing, Chapter 17. Rabbi Cook, The Dialection in Salvation. Topic. External links Topic. Religious Zionists of America Poster of Historic Religious Zionist Leaders A Historical Look at Religious Zionism by Prof. Dan Mitchman Original Letters and Manuscripts, Zionism, Ben Gurion on God's Promises Chappelle Manuscript Foundation. Kippa, House of Religious Zionism. Hebrew Official National Religious Party website in English Religious Zionism and Modern Orthodoxy, Rav Yosef Blau Religious Zionism, Compromise or Ideal, Hagshama.org. Il. The American Friends of YBA, Supporters of Religious Zionist Educational Movement in Israel.